student has been named the state champion of the 2024 Poetry Out Loud competition. Yeah, now she is taking her talents to Washington, D.C., where she will compete in the national semifinals tomorrow. Good morning, Tennessee anchor Allison Smith caught up with her as she prepared to put her way with words on the national stage. Since high school, Charlotte Bolschweiler has been training to read poetry like a poet. I feel like it's definitely given me a greater appreciation for poetry as an art form and as a style of communication. The senior at Clayton Bradley Academy will represent Tennessee at the Poetry Out Loud competition in Washington, D.C. this week. The poetry competition pulls students into the world in the mind of a poet. I choose a poem that I'm very drawn to, that I like either connect with emotionally or um, something that I just, I love the way that it sounds when I'm reading it out loud. Bolschweiler's Poetry Out Loud coach is also a humanities teacher at school, but her most important title is mom. Her poems this year have really pushed her uh, her last one, Crepuscule with Muriel, if anyone wants to look that up, it's extremely difficult to memorize and very fun to listen to. Um, she put a lot of time and effort into researching, watching videos. Each poem recitation will be judged on criteria including physical presence, voice and articulation, and accuracy. And I just have a Google Doc that I type out my poems like over and over and over again and then go back to the original see if I missed anything. It's just like repetition, getting it in your like brain. The program helps students master public speaking skills and build self-confidence. Everyone gets nervous, but the ones who are the most nervous are probably the ones who need it the most. And I see huge growth from the time someone is a freshman to a senior. Charlotte hopes other students can learn to love poetry through the program. That um, my generation uh, needs to, I don't know, lean into it a bit more and to see poetry as not something like cheesy, just about love or death, but being able to actually understand it and interpret it and being able to write it is very important. Covering education, so Allison Smith, WATE, six on your side. And best of luck to Charlotte yes. tomorrow. By the way, in all, $50,000 in awards and school stipends will be distributed as part of the national finals. And that includes a $20,000 grand prize for the national champion.